we're surrounded by water. We have hurricanes, we have red tide, we have you know, oil spills, just name it. We, you know, that affects our livelihood, tourism and, and everything. So being able to have the, the platforms, the research vessels, to do the research to try to figure out some of these things. This vessel is largely uh, set to become a floating laboratory at sea. And we do two big things with that. One is we, we, we support uh, marine research efforts around the state from our 800 principal investigators that do various types of marine science. And those are uh, grant supported activities uh, where they need a vessel to be able to get out uh, to collect data or to make observations. And then the second big use for the vessel is really for education and training purposes. Uh, Florida Institute of Oceanography gives out about 100 subsidized days a year to our 30 members to be used to take students out and do hands-on training and literally learn, uh, learn about marine science uh, in a place where it really makes a difference as to whether or not they'll, they'll end up staying in marine science and STEM education. So we estimate that a lot of the students that spend time on our vessels or down at our labs end up uh, proceeding on to uh, careers in marine science uh, in, in graduate school or, or become professionals.